native to the Mediterranean regions, rosemary has naturalized and now it is widely grown in warm climate areas. It is used as a spice when cooking, fragrance in soaps and cosmetics. Traditionally, rosemary has been used as medicine in so many ways. Let's now look at the health benefits of rosemary. Contains antioxidants, especially the canosic acid, a powerful natural antioxidant that play an important role in neutralizing free radicals and preventing oxidative stress. Also contains anti-inflammatory properties. The anti-inflammatory compounds of rosemary can relieve inflammatory conditions and have a positive effect on the immune system. Has properties that help in boosting mood, aid in mental health and enhance memory and concentration. Several studies suggests that the aroma of the rosemary helps prevent the breakdown of acetylcholine, which is attributed to improving the cognitive function, boosting alertness and concentration. Rosemary aromatherapy also lowers the cortisol levels and helps reduce anxiety. Rosemary is also good for neurological protection. The canosic acid in rosemary can fight off damage by free radicals in the brain. Rosemary is also good for skin health and hair growth. With its potent antibacterial qualities, Rosemary essential oil helps fight the acne bacteria and also helps clear out pores and form a protective barrier against future breakouts. It also acts as an hair growth stimulant. The polyphenols in rosemary have shown a vast antiproliferative capacity against colon cancer cells in vitro and in animal models. The rosemary oil may also help reduce tissue inflammation that can lead to swelling, pain, and stiffness. So how can we use rosemary? A person can use the herb in cooking or making rosemary tea by steeping the herb in hot water and then drinking it. The essential oil can also be used in inhalation, also known as aromatherapy, or it can be applied topically to the skin. Note that very high doses of rosemary may cause vomiting, coma, and pulmonary edema. Excessive consumption is also not recommended in pregnancy and breastfeeding. In the event of severe symptoms, it is very important to seek medical guidance. What are your experiences with rosemary? Kindly add your comment in the comment section below. Give this video a thumbs up. And remember to subscribe. Press on that notification bell for you to get notified next time we upload a new video. Thank you. Until next time. Bye-bye.